from Sleep Cove tonight, we'll be going on a relaxing train journey where I'll guide you into a restful sleep. Join me as we travel to Britain in the 1920s as we start our journey at a small train station before we board our steam train and we venture through the beautiful and breathtaking countryside. Prepare to let go of the day's worries and embrace a night of rejuvenating rest. So let's do a quick relaxation exercise before we begin the train journey. Begin to let go of all the tension that you have built up throughout the day. Any worries you have accumulated seem to lose their power and intensity as you settle down for the night. Feeling cosy and comfortable now, allow your breathing to slow down as you take a nice full deep breath in and slowly exhale. And one more time a nice deep full breath in and slowly exhale and let your breath return to normal now. Just observe your mind and how it is thinking of various things about your life and your day. Observe how perhaps visuals of moments flash in your mind or maybe you feel them, and make sure you are in your favourite position for sleep, letting any images in your mind's eye fade now, bring into your imagination that you now have been transported to a place and you're walking towards a long train that is parked alongside a countryside station. You have travelled back in time, and you are in the 1920s, the golden age of train travel. The train engine is stopped at an old station in the middle of nowhere, and the long train extends along the platform. It's an old fashioned British steam train, and it looks very magnificent. It's painted a deep green, and it's a very beautiful machine with gold and black accents. The train workers are getting the engine ready to depart, and steam is already billowing out of the engine. It really is magnificent. You are standing on the platform of a British countryside station and the station building is made out of sandstone blocks and it looks very picturesque with hanging baskets along the walls with red, blue and yellow flowers planted in them. You could call this countryside station being located in the middle of nowhere. It's really quaint and Everything is of the period of the 1920s, and there are a few people milling about, waiting for the train to board, who are in the period dress of the time. They're dressed very fashionably and smartly. You decide to go and buy your ticket. And there is a hole in the wall of the station, which operates as the ticket office. You give them your destination, 
and hand them the coins for your ticket, you hear a heavy stamp like noise as the ticket is quickly printed and you are handed a small horizontal piece of paper is dated to the period and is very quaint. You turn around to face the station and the sky is blue with a few white fluffy clouds dotted around. It's warm and there is a cool breeze on your skin. You walk along the platform and there are a dozen carriages all painted a deep burgundy red in the centre and they're framed by a deep yellow beige on the top and bottom parts of the carriage you look at your ticket and you can see that you are on carriage B and you look out for the markings you approach and hop up the stairs through the open door of the carriage you go down the narrow walkway to find your compartment and you reach it The opening is all wood framed and mostly glass and you slide open the door and enter the compartment. This compartment is all for you today. It's a sleeper. On one side there is a long seat of three chairs, each with divisions with a whim back headrest and on the other side is a bed set up. You sit down and you notice how opulent this carriage seems. There's a large window that looks out to the other platform where there is no train. There is a small table under the window with a bronze light with an opaque glass shade attached to the wall. Above the bed and above the seating there are three rails which are designed to hold suitcases and luggage. You hear all the doors to the carriages closing and shutting and then the station master's whistle. The train horn blows and the sounds of distant voices call. They say all aboard. You slide your window down so you can feel the fresh air and cool breeze. You get comfortable in the seat and you sit back waiting for the train to begin to roll and you look around the compartment taking in your surroundings and noticing the fine details of this special compartment and the train begins to leave the station very slowly. On the opposite platform, there are some children that begin to wave at you, and you wave back. You notice everything as vividly as you can, and take in the other side of the countryside station. You feel slight vibrations as the train begins to power up. You can hear it begin to hiss as it builds enough power to pull the massive weight of the carriages. 
a little station bell rings, alerting that the train is leaving the station. And now the train is rolling very slowly. You take a deep breath of relief, because you know that you are in for a long relaxing ride, and you are where you are supposed to be right now. You're off to journey to a special place, a special destination, where you know you will feel peace and feel so good. It may be a place that you've been before, or maybe an entirely new place. The place you are going is just for you. And you are so happy and relaxed that you are taking this train journey onwards. The vibrations under you get stronger because the train is increasing in speed. You hear the relaxing sounds of the wheels turning along the tracks. Your train finally leaves the small station in the middle of nowhere. And the station finally passes by. And the ringing bell of the station gets fainter and fainter in the distance. Until you cannot hear it any longer. The momentum of the wheels and the vibrations underneath are soothing. They even out into a rhythmic relaxing hum as the train has reached a safe and steady speed for the long journey ahead. As you gaze outside, it is still light but the sunset will be here very soon. You can see out both sides of this train compartment, through the carriage door across the walkway to the window there, and then you can look round to the open window in your compartment. You enjoy the breeze coming through, and the shadows get rhythmically cast into the compartment as you move through the countryside. You take in the beautiful views on either side of you, perhaps the most beautiful views of the countryside that you have ever seen. You see the ground close to you, passing by very quickly, and the trees nearby pass a little slower, and in the distance some rolling hills are moving by ever so slowly as the train takes its journey. You look out into this beautiful green nature, and you just really enjoy its beauty. The sun is beginning to meet the horizon, setting behind the soft rolling hills in the distance. The colours that the sunset begins to create are just breathtaking. You admire the pinks and yellows and the oranges of the sky. And over time, They fade into bright blue hues, and into the deep blue of the night sky, as that inches in into the distance. 
gentle hills give off hues of green and blues and greys. The sunset is reflecting colours of purples mixed with oranges now as it dips below the hills. The train passes another countryside station and you see people disembarking a train there, perhaps on their way home to rest after their travels. He passed the station now and the landscape opens up to green meadows and on the other side golden colours appear as he pass fields of crops and every now and then a giant oak tree passes you by standing proudly in the sprawling fields of golden crops now and then you pass little woodlands appearing out of the countryside and you imagine the little woodland creatures and birds getting all ready to go to sleep in their little homes. The view is mesmerizing and you are not thinking about anything other than the beauty that you are witnessing. You are getting more and more relaxed and feeling grateful for these beautiful moments in the twilight upon this sleepy train. You are very comfortable and ready for a restful night's sleep. The aura of the sun is slowly fading away and the night sky is chasing away the sunset. You decide to move from the seat you are in and into the bed opposite and get comfortable and cosy and you tuck yourself in but you make sure you are propped up on the pillow so that you can still see outside of the window. Your eyes are becoming heavy with sleep as you watch the day turn to darkness and your natural body clock wants to follow this. The wide meadows have passed by and the train is entering a beautiful forest like a forest from a fairy tale. The weather cools just a little bit and you can smell the trees as they close in around the train. The aura of the sun is slowly fading away and the night sky is chasing away the sunset. The moon is beginning to show itself and cast beautiful moonbeams down into the countryside that you see before you. The moonlight is just a gentle night and your eyes are becoming heavy with sleep as the day now has turned to darkness. Even though the day is dark and has turned to night, the crisp moonlight peeks through the trees 
as they pass by. If you'd like to, you can turn your carriage lamp on to have a little bit more of ambient light. You can leave it off if you prefer. The hum and the resonance of the train is so very soothing to you, making you feel even more sleepy. It's like being slowly rocked asleep, and your eyes are closed now, and you're very comfortable in the sleeper carriage. Occasionally you might open them, just for a moment, to gaze around the carriage in the train and to view the nighttime nature as you drift and float on this dreamy, sleepy train ride. You hear yourself say that sleep comes to me easily. That sleep comes, and it restores me and heals me. Tonight is the time to fully rest and rejuvenate myself. A restful night's sleep is approaching, and I'm here just along for the ride. I've done all that I need to do today. Anything that needs to be done can be done tomorrow and I can relax here knowing that I can go to that special place which I'm travelling to. I do not need to do anything but relax and sleep now. I breathe peacefully and easily relaxing all parts of my mind and body. And my body feels so comfortable in this sleeper bed. This sleep relaxation feeling comes over me naturally and willingly as I become more relaxed and sleepy. This gives my body the time to heal. It gives me time to heal my mind. I know how good this is for me right now. I know how good it feels right now. I know this time on the train is for me to relax deeply and for me to be me right now. Deep and restful sleep is possible every night when I let go of worries and stress. I know it is possible because I have done it before and when you have done it before you can easily do it again and I breathe peacefully and easily relaxing my mind and body. My breath is steady and slow carrying me into a long night's sleep and my brain slows and my creativity increases as I become sleepier and sleepier. This creative state is void of any worries or fears is completely open to me, showing me how to achieve my goals and 
entertain my dreams. I am grateful for the day that was well lived and now it is time for night. Through sleeping and dreaming, I accomplish great advances in my mind, resolve any problems, and extend into my waking life peace, serenity, deep thinking and relaxation. Now it is my time to dream. I embrace rest as one of nature's natural healing remedies. My body feels very heavy and calm. My muscles are completely relaxed now, as they are rhythmically rocked on this train journey, and any remaining tension just completely and utterly fades away. My mind is quiet and clear. I know that Tomorrow, I'll wake up feeling refreshed and rejuvenated after a marvellous sleep. I sleep well each and every night. Nothing disturbs me when I sleep. And I know that at the end of this train journey, there is a wonderful, safe and special place for me, I can go there now earlier if I want to, or I can stay on the train if I wish, if you want to go to the special destination, you can go now, you can go now and explore you can explore in your mind's eye, or take a shortcut on the train, or you can just stay here and rest in this cosy sleepy train as it chugs gently along the track, because nothing will disturb you now. You're going to get an amazing night of rest. And tomorrow you'll feel excellent, rejuvenated, healed and ready to face the day. You'll thank yourself for allowing your body to have this time for rest and relaxation. And you'll thank your mind by letting go of worries and opening yourself up to the resourcefulness of dreaming. You say to yourself, no matter how much of my dreams I remember, I know that they are constructive and offer a space for my imagination to flourish. Dreaming and sleeping allow for great vision and inventiveness to take place in your mind. And you say to yourself, I release all my thoughts from the day. I will release any tension I accumulated from the day. After my long sleep, I'll awaken refreshed and happy when I've gotten the perfect amount of sleep that I need. I am grateful for my beautiful bed and the pillow that supports me. This train ride has allowed me to be calm and full of peace and falling asleep 
is so effortless for me. I know that the words I say and the things I think will come into action. I say with confidence every day that I sleep will be easy and restful. In the carriage, I lay down on my soft pillow. I am greeted by sleep and I welcome their sensation. I sleep so soundly that my body and mind are completely refreshed and ready to accomplish anything. I look forward to going to bed, knowing it will be quiet and relaxing. It feels so good now. All the carriage lights now are completely dark and dim. As you continue on this peaceful train ride, you find yourself that you are in a dreamlike state. The train's rhythmic movements and the soothing sounds of nature outside lull you into a deeper, deeper level of relaxation. Your mind begins to drift and you find yourself floating in a realm of imagination and possibility, and the rhythmic nature of the rocking train lulls you deeper and deeper into sleep and relaxation, and if you are not already sleeping, you know that you will be soon asleep very soon. You enjoy the journey. You are just a passenger here. You just let things come and go as things always do. Sleep is encompassing you now. The train is taking you along for the ride to a new and beautiful destination when you rise. So enjoy this time and allow my voice to completely fade away just as the sleepy train rolls along.